smidget of your time to address the old shitty breath ass Negro. Do, do the girls mind? Let me let me see when it y'all girls mind. I, I ain't gonna get all off like I did the last time when I backed down memory lane regarding BS. Okay. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna go as far as I did the last time. But I just wanna know, can I just have a teeny 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 bit of your time to just address this right quick? Let me let me let me see what the girl's saying, honey. Okay, so go ahead, do it. <laughs> oh mm. I'm just making sure. I'm I'm just making sure because this is the tracker, okay? And I like to stay focused, honey. I like to keep my programming the way it's supposed to be done. But sometimes you got to interject a little bit. So I'm going to interject a little bit and go ahead and slightly and politely, well, not politely, bitch. <laughs> there ain't nothing politely for to come out of my damn mouth. <laughs> I'm just going to slightly address this weirdo, this clown, uh, by the name of SB, aka Shit Breath. Nigga, please. I wish these clowns would stop trying to insinuate shit about me. If you say you ain't gonna speak on me, just shut your fucking wide mouth ass the fuck up. Why is you still over there speaking on me, dude? Like, give it the fuck up. I've been told you what you need to motherfucking do, bitch. Release that motherfucking footage. What? So you keep deflecting from what I've been told your punk ass to do. Release that motherfucking footage of us in Orlando. And show the girls what it was really motherfucking given regarding It's Me, QB, and Fight Back. See, he don't want to do that. Mm -mm. He don't want He don't want to show y'all. Now, he done posted up everybody else from Jay Dunn, from Heidi Hall, Jay Weasel, Tim Black, even his good, good girlfriend, he done released all type of footage on all these hoes. But why exactly are you holding on so dearly to the footage of me and my girl? Huh? So all that shit you over there talking, all that shit you over there talking with your old basset hound, Uncle Ben reject looking ass, it don't mean shit to me, bitch. Cause trust that motherfucking believe I ain't never broken. I ain't shit over here broken with it's me QB and the renegades, bitch. Period. Fuck you thought. Who the fuck you think you analyzing, huh? You got some motherfucking up. Yeah, I may sometimes suffer from a broken heart because I've lost my spouse. But bitch, ain't shit else broke about me. What the fuck you mean I got a broken Bitch, you ain't in charge of my soul. The only, the only entity that's in charge of my soul is my savior, the Lord Jesus Christ and God above. Bitch, you ain't got no stake on my soul. Nigga, you reaching. You, instead of reaching for some motherfucking Listerine and some Dr. Tishner's to remove that film from your nasty ass tongue. You over here reaching for my soul? Bitch, you been hanging around with D. Ramsey, raggedy, wannabe spiritual advisory ass. Cause you got the game all the way fucked up. Nigga ain't shit over here broken. And trust, you ain't the one to fix it. <laughs> you ain't the one to motherfucking fix it. If anybody gonna fix it, it's gonna be the man upstairs. Not you. So how dare you come out of your motherfucking garbage dump 
mouth, your garbage disposal mouth, and insinuate that my soul was broken? Let's go down the list of things that we know that is broken on your ass. Uh-huh. Shit breath, Sean Bradley. That metabolism, oh, that's definitely broken, bitch. Those liposuction surgeries, those were definitely broken. They broke the skin, but they didn't break the fat cells. Those dish bottle tips, those are definitely broken in your wide ass booty hole, nigga. Pretty sure your credit still broken from all them bankruptcies you went through. And then the nigga gonna have the nurse to tell the girls he was teaching them how to work the system. Girl, please. You got some motherfucking up. You wouldn't have had to bankruptcy if you knew how to manage your funds. Oh, you illiterate to managing funds, Mr. Bankruptcy. But that's another thing that's clearly probably still broken in your segue of life. Uh-huh. As well as your broken relationship with your mammy after you sued her for $50. I'm quite sure that's broken to smithereens. Ain't no get way getting that back. Uh-huh. Ain't this the same nigga that was sitting over there with a broken ceiling? The list goes on and on. Shall I continue? Uh-huh. Shall I continue? <laughs> Just like that man piece of yours over there that's broken and torn as to if he gonna claim you exclusively one day. That's broken. The hopes of Steve claiming you exclusively, those have been broken and shattered a long time ago. And let's not forget, why you so worried about me possibly or allegedly being broken. Shouldn't you be concerned about how you broke pay pay? You broke pay pay to the point where he became broken and ran for the hills from your raggedy, disheveled body looking ass. So nigga, don't you ever in your motherfucking life think you can insinuate anything about my mind, body, and soul, bitch, because you would never be on my level. So fuck you and fuck uh-huh, anything you over there saying regarding It's Me, QB, and the Renegades. Bitch, you could never.